And welcome back at 16 after the hour. Time for Foodie Friday, of course. Now, mm -hmm. a pizza shop in the Pearl District has expanded into Lake Oswego. It's called Oven and Shaker, and it serves up vibrant Italian food, wood fired pizzas, unique cocktails. Mwah, it chef's is kiss. delicioso for <laughs> sure. Their pies and drinks are crafted with a passion for details. So, joining us live to tell us all about their menu and give us a little look at the new location is Ryan McGarrian, co founder and bartender with Oven and Shaker. Good morning, Ryan. Good morning. Happy Friday. Happy, Happy Friday. Friday. We're excited to celebrate with some pizza, some cocktails, a lot of our favorite things. So tell <laughs> us about your restaurant. Yeah, so Oven and Shaker is kind of a culinary love child between Kathy Wims, who's super notable with her restaurant in Estrana in uh, East Portland, myself and Kurt Huffman of Chef's Table. Uh, oven obviously refers to Kathy. Shaker is me, uh, the cocktail shaker. Uh -huh. And uh, yeah, we're stoked to be in Lake Oswego. Uh, I feel like we should have opened a second one uh, probably five years ago, but uh, better late than never. And uh, things are going quite well. Oh, that's great to hear. Great to hear. So talk about the menu, uh, you know, a little bit. I know you're the cocktail guy and we are going to talk about that too. But what, what's on food wise, what's on the menu that you really want to, to highlight, to showcase? Yeah, well, I mean, everything here centers around the oven and this bad boy uh, that we have here puts out these beautiful, uh, lightly charred Neapolitan pies. Uh, that's the reason I think first and foremost that you're coming here is for these beautiful classic thin crust Neapolitan pizzas, specifically uh, the one in that picture right there, the spicy salami pizza mm. oh. with Calabrese salami and honey. Uh, our salads are ridiculous. Uh, we're pretty famous for the Nostrana salad, which is kind of a take on a Caesar with radicchio and, uh, and our kale salad. So much going on in the kitchen right now. So good. That's the yeah, pizza. I was going to say, I, so good. I'm not overstating this when I say that radicchio salad was life changing for me. It is, it is <laughs> so fantastic. Uh, pairs very well with the pizza. Now, uh, of course, also a good pairing would be a nice cocktail. So I know That's cocktails right. are, are in your corner. They are. You can see this massive back bar behind me. It's kind of like, uh, oh, it's pretty exciting to have a back bar like that. We need a ladder and whatnot. Uh, but uh, yeah, we're, uh, I like to say we try to bridge the gap between uh, intelligence and vanilla and provide comfort discovery at the same time. And uh, there's me straining a drink with the famous uh, Armenian block strain. But uh, I've, got my, uh, I've got my bar manager here, Mikey. Oh, nice. Uh, and he's going to demonstrate a cocktail for oh, us. Oh, perfect. This, uh, I was going to say, I know it's early, but if you want to shake anything up, go right ahead. <laughs> No, we're actually going to stir something up. It's, uh, you know, takes a little time to get the shoulders warmed up for the shake, but uh, <laughs> Mikey's going to whip up a drink called a Mark Twain. Okay. I mean, who wouldn't want a Mark Twain at 8, uh, whatever it is, 8, 18 oh, We've been up since 2.30, so, 30, so right. I think when we get When your day starts early, it's almost our happy hour. So what's in the Mark Twain? So the Mark Twain is essentially uh, kind of a mashup between a classic drink called a Sazerac as, uh, and, uh, and a Negroni, another classic drink. Oh, it is uh, two ounces of rye whiskey. It's going to be a half ounce of the Suze. Suze is a uh, gentian liqueur, which is, I uh, think, bitter Reese's peanut butter cups. Uh, oh, wow. A little bit of Luxardo Maraschino liqueur. Uh, and, uh, and then we're going to have one dash of Peixot bitters once he's done dumping that in there. He's going to stir it up for about 10 seconds. He's gonna strain it. Remember the stirring not only uh, brings the necessary temperature uh, uh, down, but it brings in uh, the necessary dilution. And this thing's been selling like crazy. And I think this drink is really kind of perfectly expressive of where we're going with our bar program these days. Mm. Look at that stir, man, isn't that tight? Man, he was he was right on cue with you. Yeah. I mean, he, he, you guys have a system. You guys nailed it. I am impressed. That sounds fantastic. Oh man, fantastic. yeah, this isn't yeah. our first rodeo. <laughs> I can uh, tell. <laughs> usually we're not uh, crushing. Look at that nice salute to the glass. Ah. Mm. Doesn't that make you doesn't that make you want a cocktail? That, first yes, that makes me want to kick off. Sa happy Sazerac hour is one of my favorite cocktails too. I, I love me too. Uh, that is oh, so good. Fantastic. We're gonna have to go check that one out. Well, I mean, yeah, the, the bar looks beautiful. How is everything going in Lake Oswego? Things are going really well. You know, it's uh, you know, you roll your concept out in a pandemic and as the weather's turning, so you know, that's kind of like who knows what's gonna happen. But uh, yeah, we're we're just uh, Seems like the community is embracing a little bit of downtown brought to the uh, suburban landscape and uh, no complaints at all. We're just very grateful that everybody's showing up. Oh, that's great. I'm glad it's working out so well. Uh, do me a favor. Can you snag the cocktail, bring it up to the camera so we can get a, a, yeah, a nice look a at it here? Look at that one. That's right. Right here, right now. Ooh. Look at that. We'll oh. do a little, little 
AM quality control. Uh -huh, <laughs> there you go. Oh, Little taste cheers. test. Cheers. Oh, cheers. To cheers. Kick it That's better than a latte. Yeah. <laughs> Ryan, thank you so much for being here. Really appreciate it. Glad the business is going well. Good luck in Lake Oswego as well as in the Pearl. Um, appreciate your time this morning. Yeah, absolutely. Thanks for having us. All right. Have a great week and happy Halloween as happy well. Happy Halloween, yes. All right. Oven and Shaker, like we said, the two locations, you got the one in Lake Oswego. You also have one in the Pearl District over on Everett Street. So uh, worth, worth checking out, no doubt about it. Get the salad, get a pizza, get a cocktail. Your Friday night has been Just made. Enjoy